Well, this is unusual. Hey people, welcome back to my channel and welcome to Adventure for 2. This is the third episode. And we left off at world 3 and we are gonna do world 4 and 5 and I predict I'm gonna have around 5 episodes of Adventure Forward but first of all we're gonna go to world 4 <coughs> um, because I need that last third so I'm gonna show you some features in um, world number 4. Also, the game is now multiplayer, so you can interact with other people over there. Um, I actually prefer single player because there's gonna be a lot of collisions. If you guys know with me. Anyways, you guys saw the saw. Let's go up here. Oh, my god. Okay, I didn't do it properly. This is the story I need. It's called On the Edge, and I have to go on the edge. Easy, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, I'll have to get this off of there. Yeah. Okay. Um, but again, again, I won't show you like most of AF to like the worlds themselves because oh no, oh, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. okay, because I'm gonna spoil it. And so, um, wait, am I going the right way? I feel like I'm not going the right way. Hang on. Oh shoot, no, 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 no. I just realized I went the wrong way, so I'm just gonna go here. Okay. I've done the challenge, by the way, and I can have one out of three symbols that you need for accessing world 7 and 8. Also, there's 10 worlds, I just learned that. Beautiful. Um,. Oh yeah, this is all. Just have to look on the side because, um, you may get sliced. I know, not the best feeling. Actually, that's the worst feeling ever. Oh, ow, my head hurts. Okay. Uh, and three. Okay, now that's done. Um. We will go to world number 5. Oh my goodness, there's so many people here. I hope I'm, I'm surprised. This is so... Okay, I'm going to tell you a little bit about world number 5 because there's a lot going on in this. And it's actually, of course, has to do with the story. Because you may be questioning, well, why are there so many random worlds with different things? I shall show you um, this world. Ta -da! So this is basically Maytown 300 years ago. No, 300 years in the future. So we can talk to these guys. Around 300 years ago, this was once a humble lit little city called Maytown. Our ancestors lived there in ugh, lived in fear of a mysterious entity named Shiratsu, who first saw the power of stars. Shiratsu was eventually defeated by the courageous star savior, who used the stars to first our city in the in age of enlightenment. I haven't done the challenge yet, and I think... Yeah, I've got one more star to go from here. Yep. I have not obtained this symbol yet. Uh... And sunshine so is the point, and I'm gonna show you some returning, uh, returning power-ups. Look who's back! Oh, go away, you. Okay, so we got this plug. If you guys remember the plug, there's a battery ahead. Yes, it returns. Also, the robots return. So that's another rotating thing. So review, grab. The battery without getting knocked down. Grab, touch the orb, and don't die. Okay, touch here, and you make a bridge. Simple as that, right? Oh, no. Oh, okay. Eh, alright. Well, that's what I, I wanted to show you. I didn't want to show you, like, all of it. 
we need to get one more star from here and then uh go for the challenge which I haven't of course I haven't done yet this is the clock tower you guys remember that also over there actually I'm gonna show you like what's over there um just, this is a dome and you can't go in and I was asking myself why can't you go into the dome and said so to complete the challenge and you all know why no spoilers from there this guy's name is Hale and then this person's name is Snow Hey. oh dear god yeah this is my worst enemy the clock tower with like difficult like bigger difficulty also I like the song here it's so catchy hey and this is super laggy probably there's too many people here or OBS is just being really mean. To be honest, I kinda didn't think this would be like actual Maytown, but just like 300 years ago, I mean 300 years in the future, until I read the wiki saying like Maytown's possibly like 300 years into the future. Um, oh, I thought. And I remember, oh shoot, in the first AFS, and sorry, Adventure Forward. You go in the clock tower and you travel to different, like, few times. Like, you travel to the. Oh, I can't, I'm gonna spoil it, I'm so sorry. Just spoil alert. You travel to future and then you travel to the past. So, like, this Maytown. Like, I think 30 years into the past and 30 years into the future. But I won't describe, like, specifically what it is because I'm gonna spoil it. I got all the stars and now we have to attain that second symbol because you need three symbols to unlock world 7 and 8 um, so we will do world 6 and 7 in episode number 4 of AF2 I'm gonna put I'm gonna it's probably gonna be the like six episodes of adventure forward I didn't want too many episodes because I think it's like I know people are gonna be impatient or like I just too addicted to the game. Okay. I never thought I'd see the day where a new star savior would be created. Grace upon our world again. I suppose I owe you a more formal introduction to this place. Welcome to Star Sanctuary. I need your symbol. Yes, I suspect as much. A few other points had told me that Silum has sent you on a mission to seek out our symbols. I just heard of this. Silver steel fell on myself, and quite frankly, I'm a bit suspicious. Our records show nothing about such an entity at them existing. But if you really are the second coming to Star Savior, I am here to support all the way through. But before I can give you my unyielding trust, you must first pass my course to my own design to prove yourself. What do you say? Great! Let's square away. Let's get squared away. Whoa. Whoa. There has been many rumors surrounding the celestial that you are fate to meet. Where's that? What threat does he pose does he pose for humanity? Well his intentions is the reconnection of Stratus for wars. You don't seem to know who they are. Doesn't that raise even more questions? Yeah, it does. This is I feel like this is gonna be a challenge. Okay. For centuries, the Star Sanctuary has stood in memory of the original Star Savior who saved our world so long ago. You see, Ash and the rest of, the of us were comfortable with the idea of our city had reached absolute tranquility and that a new Star Savior would never be needed. That's uh, until you came along. Okay, well, I'm not gonna read through the rest of the dialogue. Um, okay. I keep forgetting I have to look backwards. What is Celestial or Stratosphere, like the second generation of Stratosphere? Where do I go? Up there? Oh, there. Oh, okay. Um, <coughs> I kind of wonder that. <coughs> um, but, eesh, up, here we go, up, up, up. Um, oh god, stars killed me. 
Uh, it's kind of like Star saying, Hello, welcome to our room. Now you must die. Okay, look, more parkour. I am definitely suffering through this. You guys know me. I am. I am not a parkour person. Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. Thanks, robots. You had to do that. Oh, God. Thanks, you had to do that to me, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, guys, I had to. Oh, God, go. Shoot. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I was so I was almost there. Okay, I'm lagging. That. <laughs> okay. And where are you gonna take me? Stop me! Hi. Will you become the next hope for humanity? Can you earn the trust of those who helped us march for the new stage? I could be the new star savior. Well, that's the point of this video, right? Okay. Huh. Okay, I did not see that coming. I forgot these guys exist. Angel. Oh my Jesus. Okay, I really need you guys here. Guys, I'll see you guys later. Um, uh, hey Angel, what's up? Now that we have harnessed the power of the star, does Celestial really stand a chance against us? What the could could they possess? That our people have reached enlightenment, and how come we never heard of them before? How could you? How could the such? How could such a threat come out of nowhere? And what powers are the disposals? Wow, that's so many questions. Got you guys got there. I don't know. Why are you guys asking me? Okay. Next world. Okay. Sorry, not very cool. Oh, it's cloud. You guys see these names are kind of cute. Are you satisfied with the direction you're taking? Are you sure that? Yup, oh my god, there's so many questions. Fine, right. What kind of legacy will you leave behind in your star savior? I don't know. Wow. <laughs> I assume this is the last teleporter we will go to. I'm a bit scared because these are going rapidly fast. And I hate it. I'm sorry, Explode One. I have to say that. Okay. Hey, yeah. Uh, I've got, got Cloud. God. Dang it. <gasps> Uh okay. Okay. Go. Thank you. And now I have to aim for those. I'm falling off. The outside logo. Or not. Wow. Okay. Hopefully this will be this is the last obstacle. And we shall go to no oh, I lied. This can't be that bad, can it? Okay. Oh, Hail and Snow. These are the cutest names ever. Have you heard the Temple of Shadows? It lies above the very spot of Stratosphere. But Stratosphere was defeated centuries ago. The temple is sacred and nobody is allowed to inside, inside it except for the sunshine. Okay. Some say that Stratosphere was somehow connected to the original Star Savior in some way. After all, they both appear around the same time disappear without one. Perhaps they were part of great phenomenon that we can't even compare him. Are you and are you and Celestia also connected in some way? Oh yeah! It kinda of reminds me of that um secret ending in AF1. You don't want to be spoiled, please skip this part. But if you collect all the stories, you go to the secret ending and it shows like a like a monochrome ish uh like start and you see a huge X. And the X is that unknown person. Um, and he tells you that you are secretly Stratosphere. So, that's it. Okay, I have the sunshine. So, you really are the second coming of the Star Savior. Yeah. I'll give you my symbol like I promised, but I'd like to show you something first. I want you. I want you to. Sh I want to. Yeah, I want to show you inside the temple shell. Okay. Nobody else is allowed in under normal circumstances, but you're an exception. A very important exception. Help save me? Huh? Oh. Whoa! What? Oh my god. What is going on? Oh yeah, I saw this in the beta, but it was different. 
Like, I see Stratosphere X. I see those markings. Help save me. Take a good look around you. Dot 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 dot. The final trace of Stratosphere's existence resides within the temple. Stratosphere was the evil force that the Star Savior defeated long ago, who was there presumed to be dead. Yet their very essence still lingers here, calling and in distress. Dot 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 intensifies. The way the essence is calling out, it sounds familiar. Dot dot dot. Okay, what's with the dots? This wasn't just a story between good and evil. Something happened here. Something that nobody has accounted for. But what could that be? More dots. Well, that's a mystery for another day. I'll keep you waiting and long enough. Here's my symbol. Remember, I'm only doing this for you. You're the star savior. It's up to you to protect this world. Whoa, this is like hardcore. Holy cow. So, that's like Stratosphere's remains of when the original star savior defeated him. Whoa, so trippy. Okay, well, let's get the symbol. Anyways, we have one more symbol to open this gate, and then we should be good. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will link the game down below in the description box if you check it out. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!